Hi hey everyone, happy Sunday, happy, hello, happy 2024, have we even seen each other this year yet? I don't even know. Hi. Welcome to my kitchen, yes he's outside, for those of you that don't know, he is my great Dane, Milo, he's on the other side of the window. Offspring are around. You're about to hear a whole bunch of noise, so I apologize. And Natalie's over there steaming, she's trying to make a chai latte. Offspring number one has just gotten himself out of bed at the ripe old time of 11.31. Welcome to life. Welcome to Sunday, Noah. And offspring number two and I have been kicking back a bit this morning. I've got my coffee. How are you? Before we get into anything else, let's see who's come to join me in the dining room today. We're in the dining room. We're in the dining room. Lee, yes, I'm back. I'm back. I'm back. I'm back. I'm back. Sandy Hayes, Hayes. Uh, hello, Gracie. How are you doing? I'm at work right now. I'll have to catch the live on replay when I get home tonight. Hope everything's going well for you and the family. Talk soon. Yay! Brit's here. Hey, Brit. Angela Sorella. Oh, I miss you guys too. I really have. We're going to get into a bit of stuff in a minute. Tina, Tina. Oh, these I'm getting emotional now. I didn't think I was going to. Um, Lee, Lee, Lee. Everyone saying hello to Lee. Elise is here. Hey, Chris. Ben Star. Oh my gosh. Yeah, all these names. JB. Hey, JB's mama. Barbara, hello. Oh. Teresa's here. G'day, Chris. Hey, Chris. Only being Chris and Kathy Weaver. Hello, hello. I have no voice, says Chris. I spent the last three days cheering my nephew on his basketball tournament. I'm such a proud uncle. Yay! Did he win? Doesn't matter if he won. He gave it his all, I'm sure. If he's anything like his unky, he'll be giving it his all. Morgana. Hello, Morgana. And I think I'm at the end. Have I missed anyone? Put your hand up and wave it around if I've missed you. Oh, my goodness. It has been. What are you, what are you, what are you doing? What's he doing? Oh, why? What? Oh! Oh, stop! Offspring have decided, because I'm down here, to put my big mug face on the big TV, and I don't like that. That's making me feel some sort of way. Wow. Wow. All righty. Um, don't turn it up because I'm going to get feedback. Send help. Send help. Um, Deborah Harris, Neil G'day, G'day. He did a great job. His team lost today, but I couldn't be proud of it. That's all that matters. That's all that matters. I've missed you guys too, JB. Trust me, I have. I have. Eve Ellsworth. Hello, Eve. Um, hi. Says a young crafty crafter. Wow. Wow. You do me like that, Gabs. So for all of you that don't know, Gabstar302 is offspring number two, fruit of my loins. Yes, I birthed. This one, Gabster, and I'm Gabster. He's in, he's in chat, right, right, right there. Indiana Hound. Dale. Uh. <clears throat> It is nasty, but I've got one, see? Um, um, I'll, look, uh, you know me, raw and organic as I am. I'm not going to, uh, there's no point in trying to hide it. I have a cold sore. I have a cold sore. Cal's here. I'm crying. <laughs> this is going to sound really weird to everyone, but I still remember the last hug that we had, Dale. Ugh. Why am I so emotional today? A lot's been happening. 
I won't explain what happened. Oh, I was wondering what that was. It sounded like an alien. That's the milk frothing. It's even bigger on the TV. Up your hairy bum, Gabriel. Seriously. No, don't apologize, Dale. Hey, Sherry. Emma's here. Good day. Uh, there's a lot of background noise i hope that's not affecting anyone who's got airpods in or anything like that but um oh, it's so nice to see you all here gail g'day yay uh, so yes i've had a really 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 um stressful couple of weeks at work um John, g'day, darling. Um, he, oh, Trina P. You can't cry alone. <laughs> hey, Trina. Um, <clears throat> really stressful couple of weeks at work. Uh, probably the worst couple of weeks. I've, I've been in this role, like what I do for work, uh, for the good part of maybe eight years. And... It's been really mega stressful, um, mega, mega stressful. I have someone who's a very dangerous person, like, um, what do you call it, um, legally speaking, dangerous, like dangerous, he's a dangerous person in society, who's one of my tenants, who's, yeah, um, basically threatened <laughs> threatened yeah it's it's just a it's a it's a whole hot mess <clears throat> oh ronnie said ronnie and mickey joe and shelby oh geez uh it has been the same for me. Gracie, my manager moved on and I have a new manager now. It's going to be okay, but still getting used to a new manager. Yeah, he is. He is, Jenny. He is. Um, he is that. And I basically came to my workplace and threatened me. <laughs> so it's been really stressful. Stressful. Um, Hannah, g'day, g'day, Fran, Marigold, nice to see you here too, sweetie. Uh, hey, Sherry Jones, if I haven't already said hello. So that's been going on. Um, I bought myself a, a new bike. Um, I think maybe a month ago. And I... It's, it's, it's a road bike, so it's it's one with the curled handles that go underneath. Now, you girl here, you know, she's not that, that super-duper confident on a bike. Um, and I, when I went to take it out, it was going to be just around the block. Let's just go around the block and get used to her, you know, like different handle positions and that sort of stuff. Uh, well, instead of just going around the block, uh I decided to go for 60 kilometres instead. I don't know what that is in miles. Someone can work it out. Um, but, yeah, I hit 60 kilometres, and that's my record. So I was intending on building on that each weekend, so going 60, then 65, one the next weekend, then 70 the next weekend. But then something else happened. Mm. Um. No, we're getting security in. That's how serious people are taking it, um, Chris. We're actually getting security in. Oh, Tina, I tell ya, I tell ya. Um, mm, what time is it now? It is 11.40 a.m. Yeah, 37 miles. There you go. I'm so sorry to hear that, Gracie. I'm giving you a big hug. I'm taking it, Trina. <laughs> uh, well, they're doing everything they can. Let me put that up a bit. They're doing everything they can to um, make sure not only myself but everyone in the office is safe. So, 
So anyway, I took the bike out for the first time about a month ago, three weeks ago, three weekends. And that kind of has come to, well, it, it, it kind of came to a pause. I won't say a stop because I really, really want to keep bike riding. I'm enjoying it. It's so good for your mental health. Oh, my gosh. I'm like, I think I'm half concentrating on getting lost in my own thoughts and then half concentrating on not smashing into anything and falling off the damn thing. But, um, yeah, suffice it to say that I've met someone and uh, we're seeing each other <laughs> and things are going well. So that's kind of taken up a couple of weekends um, where I didn't go bike riding. So jumping out, visiting with the fam and having spaghetti for supper. Yay! Enjoy with the fam bam. Yeah, absolutely, Trina. I'll catch up with you another time, Jenny. Neither. Neither, Tina. Neither. <laughs> but I think um, he knows about my channel and um, I think he might be happy to come on and meet you guys. So um, that's in the pipe works. That's in the pipe works. Um, I'm, and I'm really excited about that. Um, which is really cool. I think you, a lot of people are going to be um, shook. <laughs> and that's okay too. Sure, his sense of humor will be okay for you Yeah. Yeah. His sense of, yeah, I'll, 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 he'll, he'll, he'll have to uh, PG his sense of humor. Um, but he's got an amazing, he makes me laugh. Like, laugh, like to the point of tears laughing. Uh, a wonderful man, a wonderful man. Duffy Jones, hey, there's a new name. <sighs> hey, Bex Diamond, painting down under. You know what, Beck? Yeah, let's talk about that for a minute too. Did I meet him on the bike? No, I did not. No, he doesn't ride bikes. No. Um. Thanks, Trina. Thanks, Cal. Yeah, so, and you know what? It's early days. It's early days. Um, and that's okay. True? Mm -hmm. I'm talking to daughter-in-law over there. Girlfriend, daughter-in-law. <laughs> Come here. Hello. They're not as red. No, because it's lip balm. Excuse me, miss. You're the one that said <laughs> Excuse me, miss. Me, Better. Can't see anything else. Missy here came down the stairs and her lips were red and like, looked like she had injectables. And I wouldn't have said much had offspring number two not had a big smile on his face. And I told her, <laughs> it's not like <oink> bum. <laughs> you lie. <laughs> you lie. If you say so. <laughs> I have <laughs> Yes. <laughs> mm. So as far as diamond painting goes, that's kind of been on hold too. I mean, I haven't diamond painted in a while, um, in a long, hot minute between... Um, bike riding between um, spending time with the bow. Uh, that's just, I'm just now going to reorganize my timing, my, 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 what do you call it? My, my time, my time. So I'm being well. Thank you, Britt. I found you unboxing the huge diamond art. Now we know why it's been on hold. Yes, Duffy. Well, the plan was that I was going to lay it out on this table that I'm sitting at right now because once I start that one, she ain't going to be rolled up and put away and you know, and then taken out again. Like I needed to find a place for it to be out. And to be honest, I am the one that I did pull out that I was wanting to start. Um, I don't even think I finished that section. Um, 
Yeah. It's just on hold. It's just on hold. It's supposed to be with Pixie this morning, so stayed home. Mm, how is Pixie going? Yeah, absolutely, Trina. Absolutely. And that's exactly what I've been doing. Um, spending time with the offspring when they're here, when they're not in bed. A um, bit of bike riding. Spending time with Mr. Oh, I've got to see. Hang on a minute. What's this going on here? Oh, I miss you, Raven. Oh. Thanks, Tina. Um, yeah, so every now and then I've, I've been able to pop into Jenny's crime channel that she's got going on. For those of you that don't know, if someone's in the chat that can pick up Jenny's uh, crime cafe channel that'd be awesome um she goes every morning she goes live every morning talking about all sorts of good well i won't say all sorts of good stuff it's not good stuff but uh crime stuff and sometimes she keeps me company sometimes i'm working well not i'm driving and work driving driving and listening driving and lurking that's what i want to say um like hey Driving and working. So Driving, up, yeah, it does. Well, that's kind of like what we call it when you're lurking, like when you're not chatting. Yeah. So, yeah, you can join. I know you want to. So this is Little Raven. Oh, oh, with all sorts of glare. Tina, I'm not doing this any justice. Where can I do it with no glare? Oh, <laughs> Lord forbid I should have a notification come through. Oh, my gosh, Tina, I can't do this without glare. Put it to the side. It's glaring off your actual laptop. Ah. There. There you go. Can you see that? And then uh, that's a Nyum, pumpkin. Is that your nephew, Chris? Wow, he's thought how can he be taller than you? You're a giant, as you are. Oh, that's so cute. If you want to mod me, I can help with links. I can't mod on StreamYard. That's the thing. I don't think. Can you? Nope. I can put you in timeout. I can delete. <laughs> I can ban you, but I can't mod you. Um... Bugger. How's your tea? Good. Stronger than I thought. I think I made it too strong. You made it too strong? It's fine. Mm. I'm experimenting. <laughs> so she's made a um I'll, I'll when I get off here and on to the tubes and stuff, um I'll find you, Cal, and I'll moderate you i will spanner you up and smurf you away um i can see how proud you are look at that smile this is so this is creative chris who's mm -hmm. this one here and that's his nephew now he's six foot something something already look at this <laughs> oh my gosh april campbell g'day honey is hey. he the one that did the basketball game yes i would imagine so yeah barbara says it's a beaut it's beautiful that you have someone to enjoy life with i hope it works out for you you deserve to be happy well you know what it's early days early um not even a month yet i don't think and yet there's some we're not so don't you say <laughs> listen listen linda honey <laughs> i'm just saying come do you watch friends <laughs> yeah. Just saying, you look very happy. That you're with him. That's all. Yes, he something. makes me very happy. Yes, um, yes, he does make me very happy. He's funny. He is, yeah. Sliding doors moment. Mm -hmm. Sliding mm -hmm. doors moment. Um, it was a fair income. Sliding doors moment. 
literally like we met on a dating site not gonna lie hmm. so i swiped and i thought not a chance am i gonna have a hope in anything and i've told him this is it oh, nah he's not gonna swipe for me and he did mm -hmm. So that was really cute really cute he better treat you right i don't want to have to come over there and hurt him <sighs> again one you've got like three other people in this room <laughs> yeah true we're not even counting outside this house. <laughs> yeah he's all out in a bag of chips mm. you know he, he, so far so good the chips ain't bad <laughs> I so, uh, see. And see, say that. see. Now it's my turn to reverse. <laughs> Half of the stuff you caught, Gab's fault. Gab's fault. Uh mm huh. -hmm. So wait, like I said, wait till he's here and you guys are around because he won't hold back. No, no. <laughs> I've, I've met him. <laughs> um. Yeah, going through a bit, Fran, going through a bit. But you know what? What's my saying? What's my saying? My heart is still beating. My air is my air is full of lungs. Mm. I'm delirious. Mm. Let's start that one again. Drink my, the coffee. <laughs> my heart is still beating. My lungs. What's my saying? My heart is I still beating. have air in my life lungs. My heart is still beating. Life is good. There okay. you go. Uh, Which translates to I'm alive, therefore it will be. Pretty much. Pretty much. That apple didn't fall far from the tree, love. Gabby's just like his mama. Mm -hmm. You have no idea. <laughs> I don't want to have an idea. <laughs> How would I know what you're like in that circumstance? I'm just talking about everyday life. I see mannerisms from you, and then I see mannerisms from Gab, and it's like definitely related. Definitely relate. So let's share a story, daughter-in-law. Come in. Let's let's oh. let's let's talk. As Great. We... <laughs> Great. Love that. Mm -hmm. Let's have a conversation. <laughs> let's have a conversation. All right. Mm -hmm. So I think I've told some of the peeps this story once before. But anyway, for those of you that are new to the room and like, you know, there's no holds bar here. We just talk. I just, whoever's with me, mm -hmm. Milo's going, what is going on? But that's okay. So let me tell you a story. Mm -hmm. How do I start this story? <sighs> Your partner mm -hmm. in life. Mm -hmm. Fruit of my loins. Yes. Mm -hmm was trying to hide the fact that he got all bamboozled and embarrassed and everything because he had bought you a toy. Oh, okay. <laughs> Follow me here, right? Uh -huh. Follow me here. He, he... Glad this story is going on the internet. <laughs> <laughs> you wanted to sit here. I did. <laughs> I'm debating whether that was a good decision. <laughs> It's going to be worse for me than it is for you. Okay. What toy? We're not saying what it is. Just a toy. A toy. No, it could have been any toy. Mm. But he was being all smart arsy about it, <laughs> trying to embarrass me about said mm. object. Do you know what I returned in kind to him and said? You have the same one. <laughs> Be careful, they might get mixed up. Purple? Mine's pink. Pink. But yes. Purple. That was my answer. I was like, just as well they're different colours so they don't get mixed up. Uh-huh. <laughs> and he would have been very flustered. And he got very, he was like, ew. And he ran out the room. And it's like, you mess with an Italian mama like that, that's what you're going to get some. See? So cheers to having the same, the same, <laughs> exact same, <laughs> same. different colours. Different colours, that's fine. Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. Uh, here to brush. Toothbrush. What toothbrush? 
Um, oh, but hang on, hang on, let's scroll up. Hang on, we've missed some stuff. I missed. Uh, I got too much. Hello, friends. Yeah, I read that one. Gracie, I met my husband on an adult bulletin board. That dates me this year. We have been married 28 years. Yay, muzzle top. That's awesome. Congratulations. Um, you deserve the best. I'm so sorry you're going through all that stuff. Ah, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Um, and as long as the chips aren't stale. Oh, no, you're not stale at all. Mm-mm. Mm-mm. That's all I'm going to say about that. <laughs> Want me to leave so you can talk more? <laughs> no, because there's nothing to talk about. <laughs> that apple didn't fall far from the tree. Love, Gab is just like his mother. Yeah. You're not wrong there. You're not wrong. He is me and offspring number one is more his dad. So, yes. Um, need to go to work now. Really miss you and take care. Bye, Fran. Thanks for being here, honey. Yeah, he is. He is a lot like me. Um, following his considerate of her too. Yes. Um, and now we can see every shade of red in her face. <laughs> mm-hmm. <laughs> Honestly, it's not hard. I'm very red undertoned. I just go red at the drop of that. It's very easy. <gasps> yes, like my toothbrush, Angela. Oh, yes, indeed. Mm-hmm. Uh, mm-hmm. Uh-huh. Travel one at my house. <laughs> I like how your toothbrushes are a different colour so they don't get me up. True. It's exactly mm-hmm. like that. Mm-hmm. Exactly like it's that. Very important. <laughs> Missionaries are coming over right now. I have to go. I'd love to say, but I forgot they were coming today. Have yeah. Well, this is not a mm. thank you for being here, Barbara. Oh my goodness. Lovins? Lovins? What's that? Is that a brand? Do I need to Google this? What's that? Maybe. I don't know. You're asking the wrong question. No? No. Loveness? Love. I have no clue. Elaborate for us. We're very slow this morning. (laughs) So I went on a bike ride this morning after I don't even know how long. You want me to make you a chai? Chai what? Chai. Chai marker. Um... And I tell you, because I haven't been out for quite a long time, I was struggling. I only did 13 kilometres. I was heartbroken. Oh, yes. Oh, my God. Well, when you and offspring number two get your act together, where, where, where? Do you know I'm going to die, like, halfway, right? Like, not even. Like, we'll get, like, down the block and I'll be like, all right, let's turn around. It was great, great bike ride. Yeah. Wonderful. Mm-hmm. I think it would be a great family activity to do together. I used to be able to run 5K, but I can no longer. <laughs> <laughs> Not even close. You need to get a bike, Noah. Get a bike, and we can go on family rides. And don't worry, I'll die with you in the back. Oh, hush now. This drama queen. Hey, did you get the Excuse you? Huh? Did you ever trade the Yeah, I did. Thank you so much. Correct, okay, Chris. Excuse, correct. Excuse you, drama queen. I'm a drama god. Thank you very much. Oh, wow. Get it right. Oh, wow. Oh, wow, wow, wow. Bubbles. Hey, Sherry. It's good to be back. It's good to be back. Trina says, one one time one of my nurses went to my room and grabbed one of my toys and wiped around. Oh, my God. Mama, what's this? I'm not laughing. <laughs> <laughs> you are. It's uh, very dramatic. Is he swearing yeah. anything? Got you, Chris. Huh? Is he swearing anything? Um, talk to Chai Lady here. No, I think so. Oh, Did Gabriel have any? Yeah. Don't throw that down the sink, though. Right. What are the one over there? That's the milk one, yes, I think. So you can wash that one. That one can go down the sink. Excuse me. Aww, Uncle Quiz. You're right, he is tall. He's very tall. <laughs> Chris, how tall are you? Six foot something something. Yeah, I know, but that something something can mean a lot. Internet controlled toy. Mm. Ooh. Okay. Kind of like a Bluetooth with a remote. 
Yeah, she didn't know she was very, oh, my gosh, Trina, how awkward. I don't know. I don't know how I would. I, mm. It's Mama's toy. You can't mm. play with that. Mm -mm. Mm. You have to make it sound not inviting. So I guess toy is the wrong word. But the thing is, if a button gets pushed and it starts kind of buzzing, <laughs> you get a, three a toothbrush, toothbrush a and buzz it too, and then they want the toothbrush instead. <laughs> the three-year-old's going to be like, ooh, <laughs> um, <laughs> and start trying to press buttons on it. And yeah, it's not going to end well. Oh, Six, three. Yeah. Bam. You're as tall as my sister. Probably as tall as one of the boys too. My sister's six foot three. Mm. I don't know where I got my short jeans from. Very annoying. All my family is tall, and I'm just like a neck massager. Yeah. Mhm. Mm that could work. Although then they're instantly going to go and put it on their neck. Mm. There's that. There's that. I'm just wondering what the reaction of all the adults in the room was. Probably the same reaction we had, which was hide behind a coffee mug and laugh very silently, not want to do anything in part of that conversation, and just sit there and watch. Yeah, yeah, there's that. You're the short kid of the fam? No way. Family of giants. Family of giants. Oh my goodness. So, what's been happening out in the diamond painting world? Because, as you know, I've been a little bit disconnected. Um, and I want to say thank you to everyone who's hung around and who's, you know, come today. You did press I'm, a button on my phone. What? Um, yeah, I was very embarrassed. She did press a button. <laughs> oh, no. Okay, we're six foot seven. Six foot seven. I've met your, well, on video, I've met Chris's brother. I didn't know that he was taller than you, though. Uh, tall. No, I'm trying to. But he had struggled with doors. Would nah. he? Six foot seven, that's tall. Does he get hit in the head with like fans? <laughs> <laughs> I'm trying to get a gauge, all right? <laughs> I've met someone that did, all right? They walk into a room and they'd have to duck. And I'm always like, why are you slashed? And they stood up and they bumped oh their head on the fan. Oh, my gosh. No. Hey, Kat. Melanie, there was an Ikea commercial like that a few years ago, a boy playing with mum's toy. Oh, no. Oh, that's awful. I haven't been diamond painting in a long time, been crocheting and building Lego. Yay. What crochet do you do? That sounds cool. And Lego, cool Lego. What did you just call it? Okay. No, the other one. Lego. Say it. Lego. Say it. Lego. Lego. Don't be no. Don't be no Lego. 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 Leg. Lego. If we're going in Japanese, it would be Lego. Right. As long so, as you don't say Lego. No. Lego. There are some Lego. people in some parts of the world, I'm not going to be specific as to Lego. where, <laughs> and I've heard it say Lego and it hurts my soul. Oh, uh, that reminds me of other things, like Totoro. It's not Totoro. It's Totoro. What's it's a Japanese thing. It's Totoro, not Totoro. No. What's Totoro? It's a movie. Ah. Um, but it's like, and like Japanese animated, it's face like it's a very beautiful movie but all my life everyone's called it Totoro and it hurts me inside Channel me oh so you've both been crocheting and building like Lego, Lego. not See, Lego <laughs> I haven't been well mental health has been well I'm sorry to hear that Kath I'm sorry to hear that okay a band commercial it's on YouTube he has to duck for doors he says I'm still working on my mystery diamond painting. I'm halfway done and I'm taking a break, crocheting an Afghan from my hubby. You know what? Afghan? Yes, it's a Lego. Um, <laughs> tomato, tomatoes, yes. Lee, I didn't think you, I didn't picture you in my mind to be tall. Wow. 
I don't think Australia got short bum disease, honestly. Very much. Mm. Interesting. Half our family's from Brazil, so that makes sense why they're from. And it also makes sense why my other half the family. Mm -hmm. Um, what was I saying? Tomato, tomato. What was I talking about? I was trying to... Potato vodka. Yes. Agreed. Yes. Same, same. <laughs> I'm just... What? I was just thinking about what I was... Oh, diamond painting world. Yeah, what's been happening in the diamond painting? Have you Catch been... me up. Um, sorry. Trina P wants to know if you've been diamond painting. No, I haven't. No, I, I put it aside um, for a hot minute. Um, but I do want to start carving out, you know, a Saturday afternoon, a Sunday mornings, you know, at some point on the weekends to just sit down and do some. Uh, the work that I'm doing is intense at the moment, like extremely intense. They can vouch, well, you haven't been here, but the boys can vouch for me. I've been getting home and literally crashing out maybe an hour that, after. I saw you yesterday and you were struggling to stay awake because of the week. I can only imagine. Mm. Also, Angela Porch, is that how you say it? I can't say that I'm tall. Yeah, same, <laughs> don't worry. I'm like five foot three to four ish. Uh, I gave up because my, the rest of my family is like six foot. So, Angela is Tina's mum. And they're the cutest. And that's who I stayed with when I was in um, Texas. Oh. That was that. Opened up their hearts, their, their home. Lee. <laughs> Lee. Lego. Not Lego. Lego. Not Lego. Okay. <laughs> We're going to have the whole debate in the comments now. Just going like, how do you say it? <laughs> well, it's just completely Mm -hmm. mm, taller than me yes <laughs> it's going to be coming up at the 12 month anniversary of going over you know i was for those of you that wrote in my book um there's cal here tina and angela i'm not too sure who might be working and lurking but you three who wrote in my autograph book you know, I still haven't opened it. <laughs> yeah, she looks at it and cries and then doesn't open it. I can't bring myself to open it. And I thought, I said, oh. Jenny, it's getting so far gone that I might just leave it and do like a 12-month anniversary type thing and do it then. That'd be sweet. Mm. I'm a little confused by Trina. Four foot ten and my six house foot one. Is... Do you need like a step ladder? Wow. To that's that's a big that's difference. That's a big difference. That's a big difference. Wow. Christine, hey Gracie, welcome back. Slowly getting back into painting. I've had a lot of medical appointments, so it's been hard to set aside any times to paint. Yeah. No. Well, I'm glad you're getting back into it, and thank you for being here. The thing you stand on is a leg. Add on. Oh, oh my gosh, we're still going. We're still going. <laughs> The man might have lost his voice, mm -hmm. but he has not lost his ability to type. <laughs> no. Also, is it O or O then, Chris? <laughs> How am I supposed to read that letter? Oh, and Raven too. Yes, she did. Um, why not? I'm confused. What's she asking? Why not? Why haven't I? Because I haven't. If I open that book and start reading, I, I know it's going to be highly emotional. She'll also lose all the signatures because her tears will wash them away. <laughs> yeah. So, ooh, snow. Yeah. Snow, wow. Snow it's snow. actually cold. We're, we're moving into autumn. Mm. Yeah, autumn. We're in autumn. Oh, we're in autumn. There well, you go. February is the last day of summer for here. Um, so, March is autumn. And there you go. March, April, May for autumn. So, we're in autumn. It's only starting to feel like autumn, though. Mm. Today's got the hair. I mean, last week, what, was it last week? The week before. Mm. Well, we got like this really hot day. Yeah, and, we had a heat then, wave was, come through. It was horrible. And then literally the next day, we were like, I need the heat up. Like, it's 
Mm. It went from like 36 degrees down to 18, and mm. this is Celsius. Um, and it literally was that. We had the air conditioner going, and then we had to flick it over and, and, and put a blaster heat through the next day. It's ridiculous. Mm. I only got off my bum, as you put it, and started posting. <laughs> Is, bum isn't an Australian word, is it? Bum is. I wouldn't have thought so. Though they, uh, I don't know entirely, but they think fanny is. I don't, I don't know. Why did you start that? <laughs> We've already got the Lego, all right? We've got the no, Lego. we're not doing this. This is an age old argument. This is like a four year old. This is for as long as I've been on YouTube argument. Oh, apologies. <laughs> I was unaware. Yes, they've got it wrong. We've got it right. Mm. Makes sense to me. I know, right? <laughs> Watch it now, come. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Bring it. Oh, uh, yes, it. Nick. Of course you did. Yes. We are finally in spring and still cold here. Snowed last night. Wow. Oh, and it's right. still minus it's one. Still wow. Lisa still and I got scared. I was like, how do you walk around like this? <laughs> <laughs> did you think he was going to like just... <laughs> fall over <laughs> yeah yes cat yes it is i had a girl that was 411 was hilarious on the dance floor oh can you imagine well what's the difference between you and gap in height i'm five foot four at best and he's six foot one i believe so i don't know <laughs> that <laughs> That difference. Do you have to tippy toe? Yes. If he doesn't bend down, my tippy toe reaches his chin. <laughs> oh, cute. Well, you I tried to surprise kiss him. I couldn't reach. So <laughs> does that help <laughs> with the size difference? You know what? Height means nothing. My new bow's shorter than me. Like that that much. Mm-hmm. Care factor? No. Zero. Zero. Eve is here, but oh, but ass. Oh, I'm only four foot nine. My hubby is five foot six, and our daughter is about the same height. I am the shortest. In the no. I got so mad at my mum because. Okay, my mum isn't short, but she's not tall either. Um, she's like five foot nine ish, right? Um, so she's yeah, good height, I guess. Um, but she said I was gonna reach her, I was gonna beat her in height, and that I was gonna be taller than her, I wasn't gonna be the shortest in the family based off my dad's height. I stopped. And I never got in the video. And she also said that my brother was never going to beat my sister, who was six foot three. My brother is now six foot four and still growing. So really, yes. no, he would have stopped by now. He's the same age as Kev, no? Mm, yep. Yeah. No, he's still growing. I'm still measuring him against the wall. He's still going. It's slower. It's not like a shooting rocket, but he's still growing. Wow. No need to drive my truck last night. It was thundering and lightning now. Four inches of snow and it will continue for the next three hours. Wow. Where are you, friend? He's a good nine to ten inches taller. Yep. I'm actually. My grandmother was four foot two before she passed when I was about 12. Mm -hmm. There's something about, though, um, what grandma's being short. Yeah. Short, slightly chubby, lovable. Like, very sweet, but also a ball of anger when they need to be. That's all grounds. <laughs> I think I think it must be a real thing that we shrink as we get older. Yeah. Well, think about it. your platelets that have, like, little cushions in mm. between. As you grow older, like, you're compressing that down mm. as you get older because the longer you stand, the longer you're up, the more you're compressing. So you actually do get shorter as you grow older. Some people it's a lot more than others. But my nana used to be um, five 
foot eight, I believe. She's now my height. Hmm. So, yes, you do grow shorter when you well, grow older. I mean, my mum's mum was always short. My my dad's mum, I always thought of her as tall, but now she's, you've seen her. Hmm. She's teeny, tiny, frail, obviously. I mean, bless, bless and everything else in between. She'll be turning 100 this year. So, it's very sweet. Uh, Beautiful. Mm. Um, Likes to force coffee. coffee. Lee! Hmm. I'm going to leave that one and leave it right there. I'm just going to leave Lee. that sit right there. Where's Lee? <laughs> <laughs> I'm 5'3", my son is 6'3", and Raven is 3'4". <laughs> you got all the numbers happening. Wee. I was the height when I was 15. My brother grew till he was 19. Yeah, my dad grew till he, I think he was 22 when he officially stopped growing. So I believe my brother's got the same kind of stretch, I guess. I reckon my boys are done. Yes. I, I, I'm going to say they're done. Mm -hmm. I'm proud to say, that, you know, I'm a I'm tall, tall chick and both of them are taller than me, which is nice. Um, it's five ten. You're close to six foot. Yeah, I'm close to six foot. Um, because she's definitely not your height. Mm. Yeah, largest growth spurt I had was twenty four inches in twelve months. Wow, that's forty eight centimeters. That's like that's like about this much. Yep, in twelve months. In 12 months, was your mum, like, concerned at that point? Oh, my She's, gosh. Wait, was was this, like, puberty hit and suddenly I, kind of thing? Or was it, like, a little later after puberty and then suddenly grow? Like, what? <laughs> when in time was this? <laughs> when did your closet suddenly have to be watch, thrown out? Watch Lee go... Oh, last week. <laughs> last week. Last week. <laughs> Dad was six foot, mum was five ten. All four of us kids were five seven. Wait, me, I got the short end of the stick five three. Yes. Uh, yes. My sister is six foot three. My brother is six foot four. My other sister is six foot, I believe. She might be a little less than six foot. She might be your height. And then I'm like here at like five three to five four. I don't even think I'm fully five four. I'm probably closer to five three. Cat's brother stopped at 25. 25, that's late. Not I, really. I would think. Women stop growing a lot sooner than men. Oh, really? They start maturing a lot earlier than men. So men can sometimes, the latest I've heard of was 27 for a guy. That one was late. But I think about average, it's 21 to 23-ish. Hmm. Not to say that you can't vary. Every human's different. But that's what I've been brought up to believe yeah yes gracie is tall when i stood next to her i <laughs> thought i was you know, <laughs> you know. <laughs> yeah yeah angela i mean like you're what i saw the video <laughs> yeah i'm yeah. five three five four so angela's shorter than you yeah yeah and i stand next to you and i'm like hello <laughs> oh good times good times Although, to be fair, I'm just with me. Hello. <laughs> How are you? How's the weather? They try and get me to do all the short people stuff. Like, if something falls on the floor, they're like, Nat, can you get that? Like, please. You're closer. <laughs> so, I finally picked up my grandmother's sewing machine. I, uh, I haven't actually even, I haven't had the courage. It's in a cabinet, and I haven't had the courage to open up the cabinet yet. Mm, that's what that is under the under oh, the yeah. photo. Hmm. You get there. I'll get there. Five foot exact. <laughs> just <laughs> reached it and just stop. No, no point. Nothing. No, no point. Nothing. I reached the goal. Stops. <laughs> oh, there you go. Lee's answered you just before puberty. There you go. Ah, so yeah. So it'll be like right as you hand it. Yeah, okay, that makes sense. But that's a lot. Um, that's like 
I was taller than my brother for the longest time, and then he hit pre- puberty, and within six months, he was that much taller than me. Wow. I was very upset. Um, I do know <laughs> that... I don't... I don't um, <laughs> is there any tall people? I feel like that. When I was little, I thought if I grew too tall, I would be scared. <laughs> Cal, you're pretty tall too, though, babe. I had the pleasure of meeting up with Cal. We had a lovely dinner together. Um, but I, for, in my head, I remember you being like I met her when when I went up to Ohio. Mm. Um, but also, their average might I'm also be different, different to here. No, but I mean, I, I just gauge. When they're next to me, I know, mm-hmm. but you might think, Oh, that's tall for them, though. That might be that's average. So she might be going, Oh, I'm scared of growing tall, like six foot something. Yeah, and you're like, No, 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 you're already tall at this height. Mm-hmm. Shaloon, hello, hi, Shaloon, welcome. Have we met before? If we have, I'm sorry, but if we haven't, welcome, <laughs> welcome, welcome, welcome. Veterans of the channel, you know what to do when there's new peeps that come for the first time. Well, I had the welcome mat and give a good day to Shaloon. Cal, the one quarter is very important. Thank you very much. <laughs> that makes all the difference. Makes all the difference. <laughs> Means you have to round up. So. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Uh, the man told me it's his height and it's like, and he had to add the three quarters. It's important. I was taught that from my mom because she was taller than her sister by three quarters and that was enough that meant she was taller so that's important mm. you can't just round to the same thing fair enough fair enough so hang on five seven and a quarter so you're not that much shorter than me i, I knew you weren't like uh, our average here for a man is about six foot yeah uh or more now for a male for females average a bit shorter of about five months. So yeah, your height. Your average there. Well done. <laughs> I'm below. Does that make you feel better? I'm no. Below, I'm below here though, to be totally. Honest. No, no, no. It's fine. I'm happy with my height. It means I can wear heels. My sister cannot. She wears heels and she struggles with doorways. Yeah, it's the one thing I haven't worn around him yet. <laughs> <laughs> Buy him something. He probably wear them. <laughs> uh, that's going to make people think, what the hell? Men can wear heels. They were actually originally designed for men. They were? Yeah. The first heels were made for men. All right, I'm dying. I've got nothing on under here, and I can't take this off. So, do you want to just turn off the heater? And turn off the heater because, like, I am schwitzing like savagely, savagely. You didn't crank it off for like twenty something. Oh, well, I was cold this morning, <laughs> and now you're boiling. And now I'm boiling. We could just keep it at a good temperature. <laughs> yeah. Well, we're going to start working <laughs> soon gonna start working soon so hi uh, Kathy huh oh sorry I'm reading mm-hmm, my mm-hmm. parents weren't that tall your parents weren't tall but you're six foot and your brother's six foot seven sorry you're six foot three he's six foot seven why why <laughs> do people just get tall jeans we went to Costco yesterday mm-hmm. uh, who was I with Noah. Noah. And of course, Noah's a giant. <laughs> and when he's pushing the trolley through, and <laughs> his family came through, and you think you're short. She was like two foot nothing. And this was the mum. Like <laughs> the trolley was up there. <laughs> she was pushing the trolley, and like she was like almost the height. And then looked at her, and then her daughter was walking behind, who was just as short. Mm-hmm. And the, like, my heart, my soul, it hurt my soul. It was like, Mum, I hate us being so short. Because they walk straight past Noah, who's like, you know. <laughs> it's like, oh. Best hiding places are small. Uh, it's all a and matter of. And all the of... best things can be Diamonds are small. So, and the smaller the explosive, the more deadly. So, 
So if the best things come in small packages, does that mean the worst things come in bigger packages? No. Well, we'll just qualify better, your, we'll just qualify your you. statement. Wow. All right. Okay, <laughs> let's go. I can wear heels <laughs> and not feel bad. I can wear heels and feel bad. No. Mm. Mm -hmm. Okay, that's just confidence. That's different. <laughs> <laughs> I never said confidence for that thing. The X was shorter than me, wasn't it? Well, also a lot more creative. Uh, ex uh, qualify your answer. Okay. Every single tall person I've ever met, when they want to insult me, it's always, you're short. That's always the insult. When I want to insult someone, I go a little deeper than that. <laughs> Just saying. A lot more creative, okay? It's not always the same thing over and over and over again. Thank you. That's all you're going to bring to the table. No, I can also bring <laughs> up a whole bunch of stuff. What we lack in height comes in other things. Look at it. Do you want me to show No, that? this is not that sort of channel. <laughs> <laughs> you can go start your own. <laughs> I hear they play very well. I was also talking about creativity, but then you put that in my mind. So anyway. Yeah, if I see anything. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah. Wicked. This is my son's... Girlfriend, so she is officially known as girlfriend daughter in law, Shaloon. Yes, yes, hello, nice to meet you. Every now and then, we'll make an appearance on here. I randomly turn up, I'm like a special gift, <laughs> darling. G'day, g'day. Hi, Kim's here. I'm the two's partner. That's me. Yeah, um, I think though, it's been great catching up with you all. I am going to probably start saying goodbye. Now, next Sunday is Easter, is that right? I believe so, yeah. You're the more religious one out of the two of us. What do you mean you believe so? I was never brought up in religion. I just went to a high school that was religious. Oh, okay. Well, I'm pretty sure it's yes, Easter. Yes, Easter is next Sunday, and I know that because of job, not because of religion. <laughs> okay. Um, come back next week. You may. Thank you. I might be here. I might be here. It's Easter Sunday. So for those of you that live on the other side of Whoopsieville world, I know for you guys it's like in the middle of the night or early evening Saturday. But for me it's Sunday. So my Sundays, it's going to be Easter Sunday. Um, so I'll be wearing ears. I will. Why? Why are you doing me like <laughs> because that? Because you've got ears. And last Easter, you wore ears. You got ears. I don't know. Yes. Oh, that looks all. <laughs> I can't do it myself. Oh, now I look like I'm flipping someone off. <laughs> um, all right. So, well, damn. Wanted to see the girlfriend, daughter in law go into shock. At, at Dee Dee's. Did we miss a comment? Someone's birth weight. Did we miss something? <coughs> Is this because of how tall people are? Birth weight. Oh, here we go. Don't go throwing things at me, but my dad was big at birth. He, he was, had... He was something at home and weighed 17 pounds and 4 ounces. Wow. That's incredible. I'm not saying I'd want to do that. I'm saying whoever delivered him, congrats. Right, the grandmother would have. Congrats. I'll put it to you this way. The grandmother the minute, trooper. The minute that offspring number two came out at nine pounds, I mean, he was nine pounds. I just, I did not have any words left. And all I did to my ex at the time was this. <laughs> You're getting the sniff, in other words, which he never did. A friend of mine was born at 10 pounds, mm. but that's the largest I've ever seen. Gosh, wow, that's a toddler. <laughs> hey, Christina. All right, before we go, before we go, before we go, I'd like to invite all the workers and lurkers out there. Uh, if you want to say pop in and say g'day, now's your chance. Before we close it all up, I want to say thanks, guys, for hanging in there, being patient with me. Um, I'll try and put out some videos for you guys soon. 
But if you want to say g'day now and put an emoji of some description in there. Um, thanks, Cal. Thanks for, see for being here, everyone. Um, next week might be the full one and a half hours, but I'm, I've got stuff to do. And a kitchen to clean, again, I don't understand it. Anyway, good night, everyone. Have a great rest of your weekend, wherever you are. And thank you so much. Hugs back at you. Wherever you are, look after yourselves. Look after each other. I haven't done this in so long. <laughs> it is so, so super important. Until I see you next time, I'm going to send you all bunches and bunches of love. And ciao, ciao for now, guys. Bye. Bye.